only thing that you can control right now is the your actions and the and the um, thoughts that you choose to listen to. Yeah. And uh, if you spend, you know, Simon's had to Simon's had to pull me off the park bench a couple of times in the last couple of weeks because I've just been well the last week actually he's had to come and just shake me and grab me and go, dude, come on, because you listen you spend any more than fifteen minutes listening to the news cycle and you just want to throw yourself off the building. So uh, it's and the only thing. And Jenny's also been posting some amazing stuff from the world of Brooke Castillo. Thanks, Jenny. Cause that, and also the Michael Hyatt thing I watched the other day was just, you know, like just so relevant more now than ever is, you know, um, the, the, I mean, the Michael Hyatt thing, first of all, you know, you, as Pete Perry said, the first thing I, I realized when I started coaching and one of the first things I said to Pete and Christina Romero back in the day was that you owe it to yourself to run a profitable business, right? That's the message there. Don't feel bad about selling stuff right now because you owe it to yourself to run a profitable business. In fact, if you stay in business and you stay profitable, you're less of a burden on the government and the welfare system. So don't feel bad about continuing to trade and to continue to sell and don't feel like you need to discount things or give things away for free just because other people are doing it tough. Because if we all did that, it's a downward spiral pretty quickly and we're all going to be doing it tough. So that was the message from, from the Michael Hyatt um, Facebook live, which was really interesting. And, uh, and the Brooke Castillo stuff, I just keep, I mean, I'm not even really familiar with her work just through what Jenny's been sharing with me, but just really reminding myself of that at the moment that there are so much, there's so much negativity going on and so much negative stuff being put into our heads and it's really normal and really natural to feel quite anxious and to be quite scared, but it's also really easy to fall down that slippery slope of negativity. And the only thing when so much is out of our control, the only thing that we actually can control is the micro actions that we take every day. What do we do each day to improve our situation and improve the lives of the people around us and help our customers? And that's really just a matter of grabbing hold of your thoughts and going, okay, Yep, that is true. This could all, you know, end in tears and it could all turn to shit. But right now I'm breathing. I have a roof over my head. I have food in the fridge. My family is safe. I have customers to serve. I have skills. I have abilities. I have things that I can, I have value that I can offer the world. Let's just focus on doing that every day and not get caught up in the, the negativity because that's a, you know, that's a very quick road to nowhere. 